paying so much attention And when you're moving in another direction Don't worry, I get it Hello there, we just uh, we just sold this last night It's been on there forever It's only an old uh, fire guard Someone's put a bit of ply on it and painted Some wagon drains or something on there But um, anyway, so it sold last night So we just thought we'd show you how we wrapped big things up This would be the same for paintings or mirrors or anything like that really So here we go He says, I'm prepare that in, hopefully. Oops, Do 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 do. Right. So what are you doing there then? I just uh, I didn't cut the bubble wrap long enough, so I'm just putting a little bit in the middle. Make it a bit longer. I don't know if it makes any difference or not, but they always have, they reckon you always have the bubbly bit on the inside. So, that's what we do. Whether it makes any difference or not, I don't know, but... Gotta try it. Makes sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Now the other bit I've got should be long enough because I did have it. To be honest, I did have it wrapped up. Like in the storage place. So it didn't get too damaged. Mm. I just had to uh, take it out to show you what we're up to. We'll put a couple of layers of wrap around it. There's anything. Right. That's that. <laughs> Just stick these things up a little bit. Okay, that's that. Right, we normally, what we do, we put use some big strong cardboard on these, and we put these on the outside. I thought I'd just try it on the inside for a change. I just thought I'd uh, try it. Probably not the best time to try it when you're doing a video, but 
Um, what do we think? The more sort of air you can put in the middle sort of thing, if that makes sense. Sort of becomes a, almost like a cushion. Quite done, I scored these first and made them into little squares for the edges. Great concentration, yeah. <laughs> I'll do another one. for that for a minute. Now I've got to cut these because I won't be sure where it's gonna be. Okay, go under that. Perhaps it won't. <laughs> Don't even know why I'm bothering. Now. <laughs> I'll just put it on the outside. Never mind. I like the mesh belt. I think this will give it a bit more protection inside. Yeah. And it will keep it a bit more secure. Everything's in place now, isn't it? Yep. So. Come on. See? That's that one. Just give it a little. Put this one on the outside. Right, put a cellar tape on top of the cellar tape, if that makes sense. It sticks better to itself. That'll be alright, this will all lie down in a minute. Stick it down. And then we just got to sort the big cardboard over the top then. Right, here we are then. We're going to uh, put these big bits of cardboard on the outside now. So, just mark it like that. I know people always uh, say about the, the table, but this is really a workbench. And the thing is, We've got an auction house near us, and I mean, if it got so as I don't know, we wanted a nice table, we can go and pick them up for like pounds, really. They give them away, but um, it's just so much easier. Mm. We used to try and do it with the tablecloth on, and <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> so. I think if you want it to look nice, just throw on a tablecloth. Yeah. No one knows it's. <laughs> <laughs> it's only us and all of YouTube, no, but. <laughs> right. 
That's that. We get these off of um, the water bottle, the mineral water bottles in Tesco's. They got this sticky stuff on them, which always sort of keeps them in place. Really, it's quite nice. Right. So, and just a bit like Blue Peter. Here's one I prepared earlier for the other side. And hopefully, it's all going to tamp down. It's not near the edges because so that was the idea of putting the paper, the cardboard on, which sort of keeps everything away from everything. A bit of that. See by doing this, you can actually catch a bit of cello uh, tape on the top of your it. And that will stick, always sticks better to itself. Mm. Same here. <laughs> Lost the tape. Oh, no. <laughs> My little tape thing went off. What time to do it wrong? It's like the time it did. <laughs> Probably going too fast for it. Pinch that together, and that is pretty much that. Though. It's an almost big cracker or something. There. Look at that. So we just need to wrap her up now with some uh, cling film. Jobs are good. I'll, I'll have to get my man to help me do that, and then we'll. So you're in a mode. Yep. Right, here we are again. Um, we just wrapped this up with cling film. Bit of a two-man job with the big roll. And uh big paper up there. And then she'll be all done. So it's a bit of mess in the belt. It doesn't really cost us too much. We got all the cardboard for free. Uh, just the tape. We got this great big roller cling film from an auction. We've had it. I don't know how long we have had it because we didn't go to Swatham last year, did we? Because no. Pandemic. Yeah, so must have been so like 2019, be, 2018. It's got to be like getting on for two years, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and we all, <laughs> we fell out of it. So, is it three pounds? I think Mum said it's two pounds when I said it's three pounds, won't be? I think it was three pounds. So, other than a bit of tape, we don't even count this. Thing, Phil. Just time, really. But we don't mind that because I think you've got to think who would buy this sort of thing. There we go. All done. Lovely. Look at that. <laughs> All done. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again. Thank you. Hello, guys. Just a quick one. We bought this tape. Well, we bought six rolls of this tape. Didn't realise the uh, 
Centre was the small. So, what to do, what to do. So, got the uh, barbecue brush out that I never bought about two years ago and never used. Cut a little bit off the end. Put a screw in each end. You have to hold that a minute, Jeff, please. Yep. My assistant. And pop it in like that. And that solved that little problem because we tried it pulling it off by hand and it was a, a disaster. So, and we got another one for the clear stuff, so job to good and thought we'd just show you that. I can go and hang my brush up again now. See you later, bye.